Hello everybody and welcome to the demo for Underspace. This is one of the last games for Next Fest that I will uh, get around to playing. And I've pretty much been saving it for pretty much last. Because it's been one of my most, I don't know, highly anticipated um, I don't know. It's, it's been like a game that I've been waiting for for a really long time uh, because it looks really cool. Um, every time I've seen it, I, you know, I'm just like, wow, this this looks like it's going to be a, a spectacular time. I also was a huge, huge fan of Freelancer, so this is Speaker I'm really hopeful. Trackers report a Category 2 storm on its way to the system. Estimated time of arrival is five hours, with three star chasers already in pursuit of its core. Hemadred out. Gold 6, what's your status? Cargo's intact. System check reports no issue. Nav computer is saying we've got two hours until the jump hole, and it's stable. Acknowledged. Let's get this shipment home, gentlemen. One of those voices is either one of the most prolific, uh, I don't know, Storm voice dudes on. on YouTube, or That's it's an impossible. AI Stand voice. Gold 3 just went down. Full hull breach on multiple decks, both transports. Open a channel on all frequencies and shunt all power to comms. Battleship Hemadred, this is Gold 7. We are under attack. Repeat SOS. We have taken heavy storm damage. Gold 7, we read you and our scrambling fighters. Requesting status on your attacker. Gold 7, we read no storm. Repeat, what are you under attack from? I don't know. Man, space is dangerous. I'd really like to go to space, but things like this in the movie Event Horizon make me a little bit hesitant. I mean, it's also not like I can just jump on my own little private spaceship and go to space, but, you know, if I could, that'd be cool, I guess. Go to space today and just fly around. Go to Mars. Maybe the moon first. Maybe Europa. Hangar decks, please. Hasn't even been an hour, and they've already got billboards up. So the court convicted you. It's bad, and it's all bad. But not as bad as it could be. Mm. Let's get this out of the way. Your fortunes are gone. That's the worst one. You have a small stipend, so you don't starve, and that's about it. And finally, you're no longer allowed to hold any sort of corporate or estate titles in Baldwin Space. I can't run a company or own property? In Baldwin Space. There's nothing stopping you from emigrating and restarting anywhere outside Valdrick. What, become an expatriate? Move to Ujunus or the Axel? It's not so bad, Cardoz. I know plenty of Zero Tens out there that... Ah, so now we get to the core of the issue. Cardoz. Look me in the eye and tell me then. Tell me that I would have been found guilty if I wasn't what I was. Well, what am I? Yes, yes, you would have been. It looked bad, Cardoz. Even if you hadn't spent the past 30 years trying to piss off every high house. I love you like a brother, but Ooh. set aside your pride for a second. I found a... I don't know. You had just taken out a huge spot. insurance policy. Oh, going to follow me freighters. everywhere I go. Security systems were lagging behind, and you yourself admitted that Speaker Freight hadn't seen growth this year. Yes, and all of those had perfectly reasonable explanations. Except your convoy wasn't destroyed by a storm. What? That's what I was trying to tell you. It's where I've been. Hmm. He's my friend. Well, he doesn't seem like much of a friend. All right, so I checked the weather patterns, talked to the dispatcher aboard the Himadred. Even got access to Gold Seven's black box there, destroyed well before any storm rolled in by something. Hmm. Well, this seems unlikely. I was there watching it. Possibly pirates. Yeah, don't look into it because there's other stuff. Gotcha. It just seems like I just need to leave. 
this sector of space and go to this, like some other cool place and do something where people are a little less, I don't know, angry. Freelance work. Sweet. Hmm. I can freelance. The way I see it, the only option left to you is star chasing. How? I have no money, no assets. I doubt most people would give me Okay, I, I've got to... Uh, I don't... Uh, I would like my AI voice, but... I guess I'm going to have to... I don't want to turn off all the voices because Job. I I don't I mind. Don't have a ship. That's not completely true. I don't mind this dude. I um, managed to drag this thing out of storage. Had to pull a lot of favors to get it cleared to fly, but... Your character? Oh, God. There's no way. I, there's no way I will I'll be able... to find work. Talk to uh. the chapter master here on Valdric. They're a Macrovari. They won't care about your trial or anything else if they even know who you are. In the meantime, if you need anything, you know where to find me. You'll get through this, Cardoz. You're nothing if not competent. Thanks, Carmel. What else are friends for? It looks very cool. Uh, but anyway, but yeah, so the, the, the voice for your character, like, I don't... 100% want to say it's AI, but it sounds like the same voice that's like on all the YouTube videos about like movie synopsises and stuff, and I I just don't like it, so uh, yeah, it's like a big old negative, I'm going to have to either turn the voice voices completely off but the other voices seem to be pretty decent, so um you know, actually, I just, you know, because I know it's going to ruin it for me if I keep listening to it. Um, yeah, voice volume is just going to have to go away. All right, let's let's look at trading some stuff. Um, I have a thousand credits. Kind of weird to not have a ship right in front of me, but all right, we got different weapons, hardware, and stuff to buy. I don't actually know what's on my ship. I don't want to buy stuff if I don't know what's on it. I do. I pushed F2. Um, I don't know what I did, but I brought us here to these cool little lobster dudes. They're little lobster dudes. Oh, well, there's some boats. That's pretty cool. I feel like it took us to like the dock or something where there's like a lot of ships. I I really dig being able to walk around the space station or the city or whatever. That's super cool. Cool. Um This is like a fast travel to different locations. Quite nice. Well, uh, I don't want to buy stuff. Um, but it's cool to still be able to like walk around and admire the sights. Very interesting species. All right, so this is where I was. That's my ship. All right, we'll come back to it in a second. I'm gonna go look at all the places. What is this place? Storage terminal. Who are you? Oh, cargo trader. Eh. That's pretty cool. A lot of stuff we can trade and stuff. Power meets prestige, something new, very nice. Ooh, ooh. Oh, is this a ship dealer? I think this is like a ship dealer. Oh, yeah, it's a shipwright. Ooh, we can look at some new ships. Sweet. I can't obviously afford anything because I got $1,000. But I can look at some new ships and admire them. Um. Okay, they, so these are all, they all look this relatively the same. I mean, I think this looks nice. I'm only looking at like the aesthetics because I mean, I can't buy anything at the point at this point, so I'm, I'm not going to worry about it too much. 
I like this ship too. It looks nice. Well, that's pretty cool too. I uh, probably will go for this. They're like triangles. All right. Well, customize ship. Open ship dealer. Ooh, can I just customize my ship? Yeah. <laughs> Good. All right. So. Um, I'm gonna go with some red and then some like kind of like darker blue. Yeah, I'm like super satisfied with that. That looks really nice. Uh, I don't want to strip the engines or the decals. Nah. No decal. Ooh. This is what the monitors will look like. Uh, oh, yeah, I like that. No dashboard items, nothing, nothing. Ooh, headlights. So we can change our colors? What? Oh, uh, man. I don't know how this is going to go, so... We'll just keep it with white, so that's pretty cool. Uh, definitely pretty impressed with um, the inter the interaction between like being able to you know jump around the space station and go and do a bunch of stuff. That's really cool. Like I'm really you know happy with how that works. It's quite nice. All right. Um. I feel like I'm supposed to probably come here and talk to somebody. Uh, obviously not that person. Uh, maybe it's just I did come here so I could go to the launch pad. But let's check out our quest, of which there are none. Talk to the chapter master with F to begin a campaign mission. Okay. Oh. I guess it was just like they were waiting until a certain moment to, to make these guys want to do stuff with me. I don't know. Sixty-five thousand. Sweet. I'm in. Take that. It seems like a pretty cool job. Seems like it's probably a terrible idea to do with my ship being like not very good, you know. All right. Well, we're, we'll we'll just we'll go to our thing. All right. So go to here and meet the rest of my squad mates, which I did. Oh well, never mind. We're going to space. We. I feel like that's like a totally unsafe exit trajectory. Flying against the flow of traffic to go to space. Seems like an odd choice. Oh, sorry, dudes. It's not my fault. I'm going to turn the um, voice fact, voice acting um, back on just to kind of see if it's a little bit more tolerable.
The music's kind of an odd choice. Like, I, I definitely uh, will say this is not what I expected in music. Wait, Red 4, this is Idol Smasher 2. Ready to escort. Roger that, Idol Smasher 2. You think they'll come? Our teams have been hitting them as hard as possible, cutting off supplies where we can. With everything we've done, an opportunity like this is too good to pass up. Roger that. Forming up. Let's hope this works. It's very cool. We've got contact. Lane this is what I was saying. They're desperate. Oh, how do I get like out of it? There we go. Along this route. Normal lane line raids, sure. But these aren't your typical washers. They're much more organized. Let's get to work. Alright, so. Oh, he's got shields. Oh, he's not gonna last it out. He's he's oh, he's dead. Gunboat incoming. Good. Let's see what they're bringing to the table. Squad mate down. It definitely captures that um, kind of freelancer feel of flying around with your mouse and shooting ships. Um, I will say, oh, oops, he's I shot like the the wrong guy. Um, I would say that uh, thus far, like combat feels really nice. That was the last of them. I expected more resistance. Hmm. Let's get through to Spolin. Team, if you've taken damage, deploy some hull webbing. No, I have not. Probably. Have I? I don't know. Nope, I'm good. Uh, what I want is to get all that loot that I didn't get from the ships because I didn't know how to do it. Oh well, whatever. Let's head back on to our adventures in space. This comes out in April, which is like not far away we made at it. all. Something feels off. Red Squadron, this is Blue Squadron. We heard you ran into some trouble. Less trouble than we thought. Where are your escorts? They stayed behind, had a gunboat come in that they wanted to take care of. Was there any sign of him? None that we could see. Rishan's right, something's off. Yoon. What about Green Squad? They should have been the first to arrive. I haven't heard anything. Yoon, Rick and Ren's shipyard isn't responding. Green Squad was supposed to launch from there. Damn it! Cardaws, we're forming up on you. Let's get to Rick and Rend, but stay alert. The UI is really good too. Like, it's not difficult to kind of figure out where I'm going or what I'm doing and being able to switch over to uh, the different things on the screen with the push of a button is really, really nice. Like, from um, a UI perspective, I'm, I'm, I'm very satisfied with uh, how this is going. Am I like dark with the Rick and Rend lane line? That is this. I am told I have no entry. Oh wow, my my old dude hit me! Like thanks a lot, guys, jackasses. All right. Um, I guess it's this one down here then. Yep. This is UHC Green One. We need reinforcements at Rick and Ren Shipyard now. What? Green One, this is Idol Smasher Two. Where's your convoy? It's gone. The 
the doomsdayers blew it up in the dry dock. I don't think they were after it. But... We've got more coming. Get to Rick and Rent now. I think we found the rest of the washers. Break formation. Keep them away from any civilians. This place looks like it's uh, seen some better times. I saw a comment where somebody had said basically uh, one of the only things they didn't like about this is um, background music. Uh, it just felt like it, I think, you know, it just didn't quite match what they were thinking of. And I totally understand. Um, Fighters are breaking off. They're just leaving everything lying about. They didn't even bother to pick it up. They wasted a whole gunboat just to make us think they took the bait. I told you they weren't after us. There was another convoy moored, a junk tech hauler carrying starship cores. It managed to get free, but the doomsdayers were doing everything they could to take it out. I've never seen anyone fight like that. What about Bravado? He was your escort. He took the junk tech ships and fled into the nebula. They were hoping to shake them until reinforcements could arrive. Yoon, I haven't heard from them. Give me their last known coordinates. Rishan, form up. Card up. Rick and Ren down. No sign of EBZO. This is bad. What's going on here exactly? These don't seem like normal washers. They're not. You need to understand that there's a lot of sects within the washers. <laughs> Heretics. Uh, that, I hear that is something else. Of their core um. Beliefs. These ones, though. We call them doomsdayers. They're crazy even by crazy standards. But yeah, the music but they were is... never really a problem. Definitely right. doesn't fit ago, the gameplay. I don't know. Active. It just they've gone from small raids to out and out looting feels, fortified feels a bit bases. off. They've been taking insane risks. Her voice actor the thing about the sounds really good. Is that they don't value their own lives. Their crazy schemes have succeeded just enough to give them an edge. Now suddenly they're armed, organized, and far more dangerous. So the I cannot go to my cockpit. Suicidal as they may be. When they doing the fast, around. never mind. They've been able to give us the wrong button. more times than Hat would care to admit. Collection what are they looting? Sale. What are they after? I'm not sure. Hat's more into that kind of overarching plot stuff than I am. He thinks they're building something. If they are, they'd probably need those starship cores to power it. That'd be nice to get new engines to uh, make this to go a little bit faster. Um, but yeah, so like so far, my my first impression is really positive. Like I really like being able to walk around the space station. Space itself is is pretty cool. Like I will say, it feels a little bit less um, graphically impressive than you know some of the other. Bravado? Space no sims sign. that were out, like um, like Hell ready. Galaxy, as an example. It looks really cool. Um, lots, a lot of flashy, good sound effects. Uh, but overall, like my experience has been really good. Um, I really like the combat. The combat feels really good. Um, Raining gravity surges near some wreckage. What the hell is that? Collapse jump hole. Don't get too close and focus on the fighters. Uh, being able to switch around, uh, you know, the UI, all the different things so easily has been really nice. Um, Another gunboat's coming in. But I've Looks been really like impressed. Sort of armor. No, please cross them up, no. With how easy uh, the you know combat is to kind of pick up it's not that the combat is easy in itself like i can imagine like you could easily kind of find yourself uh getting destroyed if you're a really terrible pilot um however like when it comes to targeting your enemies when it comes to you know actually shooting them collection failed uh, of course it failed because why would why wouldn't it uh, but uh everything works really really Easily to, to do everything that you need to do. Um, Collection failed. I do wish that um, things like my energy um, were displayed on the outside of the ship in some way. 
uh, instead of going back into my cockpit just to kind of see like how things are doing. Jump hole starting to fluctuate wildly. It looks like it's starting to swell up. It's going to implode. Get clear. Collection phase. That was close. Is there any sign of Bravado's life pod? Anything? There's nothing but wreckage, Yoon. He's gone, as are the cores. Damn. Hat won't be happy. Bravado had been part of the chapter for over a decade. But that's normal, right? We're star chasers. You sure you're a star chaser, Cardo? Yeah, Cardo's... Rookies might and die I, by I, the score, but I it absolutely takes a lot to kill will him not be able to, Does this like, have anything to do with the collapsed jump hole? Maybe. Listen to his voice. It uh, certainly gives us a clue as to how these cultists keep getting away from us. They've got something that can collapse jump holes. We've just never arrived quick enough to see it. We need to report back to Hat for this. Cardoz, you're the newbie here. You've got first rights to loot what you want out of all this. If I might make a suggestion, though, you'll want to head to Rickenrend and get yourself outfitted. I can't tell you what's coming, but I can tell you it's not going to be easy. Take care of yourself, Speakerson. I have leveled up. I can gain levels by looting ships quite more times and otherwise increase your total net worth. Alright. Forming on you, Yoon. Go to our this and look at what we can do. We did get 65,000, so it means we can buy a new ship, which is nice. Danger. Incoming storm. Alright, well. Ah, oh, darn. Looks like I just missed the idol smashers. Collection fail. You again all the same, rookie. You here for the storm? If so, I could use a chasing partner. Not sure I'm qualified. Bah, it's a cat one storm. No better time to learn. Here, I'll shadow you and sh Show you the ropes. Forward okay. to the rift. I, 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 I didn't want to, like... I didn't want to do that. I wanted to go to, you know, oh, is that like a giant space tentacle? Oh, that's creepy. Weather seems nice. That's sure to change. Always does. I just wanted to go and like, I want to do my upgrades and go to do the ship stuff, but... Oh well. Uh, we're gonna chase this incoming storm. An old Kaylee. Kylie? I don't know, I can't tell exactly what it is. Looks like like it could be a ship, it could be some kind of like weird space bug. Serpent incoming! Looks like old Kaylee finally left her nest! Hope you know how to use your dodge thrusters, Rookie. Let's go. I do not know how to use my dodge thrusters, and if I had to guess based on how much damage I've already done to it, they will not be necessary. Maybe they would have been necessary for that explosion. Nice and clean. The veil drinks collection failed. Like We're not done yet, though. The snake's dead, and that means the rift's vulnerable. Let's get there and open fire. All right. Sounds exciting. I, I do like this part. This is pretty cool. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna finish. <sighs> Are you serious? Come on, man. Why why do like your your AI teammates feel like it's such a important thing to do to just crash into you? Like how does that make any degree of sense? Bad piloting. Um anyway, you know, I, I'm gonna go through here and do this rift. I will um probably make it back to the station and buy a ship. Um I'm not really sure what is going on here. Like they said to fly into the rift, which I have done. I don't get it. Am I supposed to shoot the rift? And there we go. Clean and easy, just like a cat one should be. 
talent for this rookie. I guess I was. You probably need some more outfits, mind you. I guess. Most folk would point you to Rick and Rend, but I can make a suggestion. We're right near Kaisa's circle. If you're looking to live a different sort of life, check the job boards and talk to the bartender there. They're an old flying buddy. You take care now. I wish there was a little bit more in okay so if you click on it just in the right time you see that they have some ships and some some data for sale so I'm gonna go there I'm going to uh, look at selling the cargo that I caught I am going to then um, buy a ship and then that's gonna be the end of the video I do quite like this I've enjoyed my time with it um, the the voice for your main character I, I i hope they add like a, the ability to turn off uh voice for your character but keep everything else because i think the rest of the voices were were decent like they were good like i mean i i didn't hate them um card odds or whatever your, your character's name it sounds like the, the the crap on youtube where the guy's like um you know, explaining videos and, you know, I hate, I hate those. So it just makes me think of stuff that I, I just like, um, which I don't really want to associate with a game that I'm, I'm trying to enjoy, enjoy, so. The music makes it seem like we're watching Pirates of the Caribbean. Are they, are they running away? No. Seem like it. I don't know if I got hit by like a rocket or or what happened. Failed. All right. Go dock with a station. Uh, that was a, a little bit different. Um, I don't know why we, they, they wanted to attack like, but I can't like run away. I mean, I got to teach people these these space Denzians that if they want to attack me, that they're gonna have to deal with my bullets, my lasers. Merit auto dock, which is nice. Big structure out in the field. Looks like a gate. All right. Well, I need to take a look at this uh, and kind of see what we had here because there's quite a bit of quite a bit of things that we can upgrade, which is nice. Um, cool rep reputation. Uh, some records. lore history so that's cool all right but let's see shield recharge rate seems like a good idea salvage rate I don't know that seems like a good idea I don't know what I wave I don't know what I want to do because I don't know if I want to be like a uh, like a more of like a trader or if I want to like shoot stuff um and I don't understand max ammo. Like, I mean, I don't. Maybe it's because I only have laser weapons. Uh, I'm gonna do some points and shield. A little bit with our salvaging reputation gain. Yeah, we'll do that. Alright. So, we leveled up. None of that actually really matters for, um, 
for right now because I'm not actually um, I really didn't do anything except for sell some stuff uh, do I not have anything like I literally didn't pick anything up in my in my ship really view inventory cargo I didn't pick up anything. I totally picked up some stuff. Alright, well, okay, that's kind of weird. Maybe we can buy a new ship. Looks nice. Uh, these are all the same. It is the freighter. I'm a big fan of the freighter. We'll do the medium freighter. We'll trade in the ship. Transfer all the cargo. I feel like I may have done this. improperly oh maybe I didn't we'll see if I can um, check out for a mission perhaps oh all right uh, it could be just because uh, I haven't scanned any data oh that's kind of cool all right, well, I'm going to just kind of launch the new ship just to kind of see what it's like, and then that'll be... I think I might have... Never mind, for a second there, I thought maybe I sold my ship and I was screwed. Collection failed. I feel like the ship's actually a little bit. Well, actually, it may not be. Shield offline. It may not be. Oh. Shot me with a rocket from the very beginning. Very not cool, dudes. Projectile inbound. Shield online. Now we can do some pretty cool maneuvering, which is quite nice. So yeah, I mean, like, there's a lot to like, I think, about, um, you know, the combat system. Um, overall, like, it's, you know, it's very, very promising. Like, I am very hopeful um, that when this comes out in April, there's been a little bit of polish added. And, you know, that ultimately it just kind of keeps being uh, a game that I quite, quite enjoy. I don't know for sure that I would consider it, um, you know, that it's really going to kind of beat out Freelancer. I think that would be really difficult, but I would say Projectile it's definitely very similar and it is good. Like I, I've had a good time with it. I, I definitely recommend this. Projectile shield um, Projectile inbound. Uh, you know, I just wanted to blow up this one ship. Collection failed. Shield online. Projectile inbound. Eh, we get a little bit faster. Collection failed. Alright, so they said use B and it would, uh. Um, Collection failed. Kind of like give you a marking of something in space. Collection failed. I don't know what it's like Collection sending failed. us to. Collection failed. Collection failed. Yeah, I have no idea what I'm like flying towards. 
Uh, I guess we fly towards this. What is it, a black hole? Yeah, it's a Cadrix jump hole. Let's just go in it. Going in it isn't an option. Collection failed. Collection failed. Collection failed. Collection failed. Collection failed. Oh, it definitely makes it kind of Collection unfortunate failed. trying to find exactly what we're looking for. Um, Collection failed. Yeah, find a strange gate. Collection <laughs> failed. Looking for our. Using our long range scanner to find gold pulses which Collection I'm doing um, but I don't see any gold pulses so maybe we're not anywhere near it anyway it doesn't matter like I mean I like I said I, I was gonna do the things that I did and I did the things um, overall like I had a good time with it I definitely recommend it I think it's a good game um, you know so links in the description if you want to try it before the weekend's over and you can still play uh, this during next fest and um, I don't know, it's these little pirates of Caribbean in, in space. And that's that's uh, seemingly the music that we're listening to.